Hello and welcome to this learning video. The topic of this learning video is lines of regression. Before we start this topic, I would like to suggest you that you must go through the first two topics which is fitting of curves and second one is correlation because in this topic of lines of regression we would be using the terminologies that we have already learned in fitting of curves and in correlation. So let us start with this lines of regression. So first of all I would like to tell you this uh, application of lines of regression first. So the lines of regression has its application in forecasting predictions and this regression being linear it minimizes the error in predictions okay now let us see what this lines of regression is so if there are two variables x and y and they are correlated and we have already seen if two variables are correlated there exists a relationship between them right then a graph of points which shows the relationship between the two sets of data which would be more or less concentrated around a curve then this is said to be a curve of regression. In particular, if the curve is a straight line, then it is called as line of regression. Okay? And this regression being, uh, this line of regression, so in the regression uh, would be something like y is equal to ax plus b. So, as this is a line of regression, it would be a linear. Okay? So, the regression or here is a linear okay and the line of regression here is a straight line which gives the best fit and that is what I have said that you must go through the first two topics okay the line of regression is a straight line which gives the best fit by the method of least square for the given data that we have already seen okay now let's see what are the equation of lines of regression okay so, the equation of lines of regression, here two types of regressions are there. One is y on x and second one is x on y. So, let us see one by one. The equation of line of regression of y on x is given by y minus y bar is equal to r sigma y by sigma x into x minus x bar. So, this is the equation of line of regression of y on x. This can also be written as y minus y bar is equal to summation xy upon summation x square into x minus x bar. Okay. So sometimes we will be using this to get the results. Sometimes we will be using this. Okay. So, depending on the problem, we will make use of any one of this. Okay. Now, similarly, now looking at this equation of line of regression of y on x, can you able to tell me the equation of line of regression of x on y? So, pause the video for a few seconds. Try to understand this equation and with the help of this, try to write down the equation of line of regression of x on y and then resume the video. So I hope you might have written the correct equation of line of regression of x on y. So can you help me out? Yeah. So those who have written can check from here and if someone can help then they can tell me. Yes. So it should be x minus x bar is equal to r sigma x upon sigma y into y minus y bar okay and this can also be written in this way that is x minus x bar is equal to summation x y upon summation y square into y minus y bar okay so these are the equation of lines of regression first we have seen y on x and next we have seen x on y right now you may be wondering what are these things r sigma x by sigma y 
x minus x bar x you know that is the given data x in my what is the x bar y bar so let us see all this now this x bar and y bar are mean values are mean values of x and y respectively okay next is this r sigma y by sigma x and r sigma x by sigma y r regression r regression coefficients r regression coefficients of 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 lines of regression of lines of regression of y on x and x on y respectively okay and what is this r do you remember yes this r is nothing but coefficient of correlation yes correct coefficient of correlation simple okay now i would like to make few remarks on the basis of this r okay so now i would like to make few remarks over here on the values of r and also on the lines of regression so we will write it as a remarks so the very first one is lines of regression lines of regression always always passes through always passes through mean values passes through always passes through mean values that is x bar and y bar okay that is the first remark that you need to remember now on the basis of the values of r we have some results the one is if r is equal to plus minus 1 if r is equal to plus minus 1 then the two lines of regression coincides with each other okay and if you have two lines coincides with each other what would be the angle between these two lines either 0 or 5 okay then two lines and two lines coincides coincides two lines coincides and we will find and we will find only one straight line only one straight line okay third one is what about if the value of r is 0 if r is equal to 0 then then the variables are independent then both variables the both variables are independent both variables are independent and and they cut each other and the two lines and the two lines cuts each other at right angle at right angle okay so these are the three important remarks because on the basis of these these three remarks there may be two to three mcq type of questions can be made and as far as the second and third one 
third remark is concerned we are going to take a problem where you will realize like how this uh, r is equal to plus minus 1 gives us uh, only one straight line that is the two straight lines coincides with each other okay and if r is equal to 0 then the two lines intersect each other at 90 degree okay so this is what we have in the introductory lecture on lines of regression in the very upcoming lectures we will come up with the variety of problems okay so till then keep watching and thank you for watching this learning video thank you